Hi there. I don't know about you, but I've met quite a few people who, when they talk with me, they say, I would just love if I could wave the magic wand and have my life be different. Have you ever thought of that? You ever thought that maybe your life isn't quite how you want it? Maybe your life is okay. If your life's fantastic and it's just how you want it, you probably don't need to listen to what I'm going to be talking about in the next few minutes. But if there are some things that you would like to change, if there are some things that you thought, if only I could wave the magic wand and make something different, well guess what, maybe you can. The place I'd like to start with you is the question along the top of this chart here. Why are you where you are in your life? You see, there's a reason why you are where you are. And you have more to do with that than maybe what you've thought about before. The fact of the matter is we all create our life to some extent, perhaps more than we initially thought. You see there's you and there's your life and the results that you create in your life. How do you create your life to be the way it is? Well firstly is to understand that you and your life are not the same thing. There's you and your life and you actually make your life to be a certain way by your actions and your choices. So the way that you think, the way you make choices and the actions that you then take shape your life and your results very much. That has your experience, your life conditions in the way that they are. What's going on in your environment, the way people are around you as they respond to you and your choices, your actions, your words, the thoughts that you express. And so there's a loop going on here between you and how you create your life and results and the conditions that you experience, how you feel, is a big part of the result of the life that you create. Okay, so this is a cycle. We talk about things like the cycle of life. Well, this is how you create the cycle of your life. As you move through this cycle, one of the things that you might be asking yourself was, well, if that's how I'm creating my life now, how could I create my life to be a bit different? And this is where the power becomes yours. With the cycle that's created in the way that you make your choices and you take your actions and you do your behaviours, your results, the life conditions you experience, mean that you have to make different choices. You have to take different actions in order to make your life different. It begins with taking responsibility. Not responsibility for everything in the world, but responsibility for your stuff, as I sometimes phrase it, highly technical, I know, but you know, taking responsibility for your stuff, your choices. You see, that gives us responsibility, the ability to respond in a wider range of ways. When we actually own that we're responsible for how we're doing what we're doing, we empower ourselves. We stop blaming other people and we put it in our hands squarely and we say, I did that, so if I do something differently, I will create a different result. And that's how you do it. Some people instead fall back on their stories and their reasons and they'll have lots of yarns to tell you about, well, you know, this happened to me and my boss this and my wife that and my situation this and my bank manager so on. Hey, you, me and many of us, most of us in fact, have many stories we could tell. And there are moments in our lives when we feel that they're very valid, that they're very real for us and that sometimes I understand they can seem overwhelming. There's time though to take a big breath and straighten up and say, if I want to have more ability to respond, if I want to generate more of that power called responsibility in my life, we have to stop falling back on these. And we have to say, I'm going to take some different actions. I'm going to make some different choices. You see, here's something that you can do. You can get profoundly related to your life. Now if you're like me, when I first saw this phrase, and I say, well, what does that mean? What is that about? What is it to get profoundly related to your life? It means that in taking responsibility and increasing your ability to respond, that you become in charge. 
you change the nature of the relationship with your life because you're examining have I created the life that I want by what I've been doing so far? Am I willing to do some different things? And just in those moments of willingness, in those moments of asking yourself the question and owning who's actually responsible for your life, you become someone who has much more choice. You become someone who has the capability to go into a place of much more freedom about how you run your life. Because you can generate different results. You can experience different life conditions when you make different choices. That arises from responsibility and a change of thinking. I'm Mark Clarsen. I'm an NLP trainer. That means I help people work with the power of their mind to understand how they're creating their life now and how they can do things different. Emotionally, the power of your mind, your relationships, your work performance, and a lot of those things that for you, maybe it matters to do your life in a different way. See you again soon.